The other big story we're following for you, medical professionals, including 15 doctors from the Mid-South, are named in an indictment. One doctor alone is accused of writing prescriptions for more than 4 million pills. Local 24 News reporter Dave Deathlink is live for us in the studio this morning with more on this investigation. Dave. Hey, good morning. Well, this massive federal crackdown involves several states. Locally, we're talking medical professionals, all the way from a Memphis psychiatrist to a collarbone anesthesiologist. One of the defendants allegedly trading sexual favors for prescription pills. Now, Jeffrey Young, featured here in this video, this YouTube video, is one of the defendants. He's a nurse practitioner who calls himself the Rock Doc. He's accused of prescribing dangerously powerful combinations of opioids. Investigators say he traded the drugs for sexual favors. Now, Memphis endocrinologist Dr. Thomas Hughes was also arrested accused of writing illegal testosterone prescriptions for himself. He reportedly used other doctors' DEA numbers to get the hormone. And psychiatrist Richard Farmer is also under the microscope this morning, accused of distributing narcotics without a legal purpose. Now, investigators say he was prescribing opioids to known addicts, and these are just some of the violations spanning multiple states. These cases involve approximately 350,000 opioid prescriptions and more than 32 million pills. The equivalent of a dose of opioids for every man, woman, and child across the states of Ohio, Kentucky, Tennessee, Alabama, and West Virginia combined. Now, in total, this investigation includes 60 people, 53 of them, again, are medical professionals. We're talking more than 350,000 prescriptions, millions of opioids. Again, a news conference is scheduled at the U.S. Attorney's Office in Memphis later today. We, of course, will have a crew there to bring you the very latest. Live in studio this morning, Dave Detling, Good Day Memphis.